a, a lot of the inspiration came from the work that I'm doing right now with the San Francisco Opera as a teaching artist in the classroom. I go in and work with uh, first through fifth grade teachers in their classes to create original short operas. I was inspired by the idea of what if I did it in an after school setting with seven to nine kids and a few adults and how could we come together as that tight unit family to make something with more time and, and more resources. And so I thought, well, opera is very dramatic and kids are very dramatic, so this seems like a good matchup. When you're a young kid, it's, it's very difficult to use language to communicate anything, but music was such a very intuitive uh, way to communicate with anybody and anybody could understand how you're feeling almost instantly through this medium. One thing that art in general and also your work creates for kids is to allow human beings to express themselves with other um, means that are not only words. As you said, uh, emotions and stuff like that in music, but sometimes in a painting and so forth, they succeed really in coming out as in a way that never words can do. If you just give them a platform to do something, they'll surprise you. You know, the work that you do at Little Opera is, is very inspiring. And I wish when I was growing up that I had something like that. I would definitely like to thank the bands that are here. Ghost Town Jenny, Lara Insera, Stone Foxes. Thank you all for donating your time and being here. Thank you very much, guys. Enjoy it. There's more drinks in the back. You should have some.